In this video, we'll share the top 15 things to do in Cluj, Napoca. At number one, we have St. Michael's Church. This stunning 15th century Gothic church on Uniri Square is a testament to Cluj, Napoca's rich history. Not only is it an architectural marvel, but it also holds significant historical events, such as the crowning of the 15th century King of Hungary and Croatia, Matthias Corvius. At number two, we have the Cluj Napoca Art Museum. Housed in the majestic Banfi Palace, this museum boasts works by some of Romania's most celebrated painters. The late Gothic altar of Jimbor, a 16th century polyptych, is a must see. At number three, we have the Botanical Garden. This 14 hectare garden, established in the 1920s, is home to 11,000 different species. From a serene Japanese garden to a vast collection of dried plants, it's a nature lover's paradise. At number four, we have the National Museum of Transylvanian History. Dive deep into the complex history of Transylvania, from the Paleolithic period to medieval times, all housed in a charming red pastel painted building. At number five, we have the Pharmacy History Collection. Located in Casa Hints, the oldest pharmacy in Cluj Napoca, this museum offers a glimpse into the evolution of medicine in Transylvania over the centuries. At number six, we have Parkul Central. This historic park, over 190 years old, is a perfect blend of nature and architecture, boasting graceful alleys, a marble fountain, and the striking old casino building. At number seven, we have the Orthodox Metropolitan Cathedral, a masterpiece of the branko venesic style. This cathedral is a blend of Byzantine and Renaissance architecture, adorned with breathtaking interior mosaics. At number eight, we have the Pierrists Church. As the first Baroque church in Transylvania, it holds a special place in the region's history and is adorned with intricate sculptures and murals. At number nine, we have the Romulus Buia Ethnographic Park. Experience Transylvanian rural life through 200 historic buildings, including two 18th century Saxon churches with murals inside. At number 10, we have the Reformed Church. Serving Cluj Napoca's Calvinist community for almost 500 years, this Gothic church boasts a richly ornamented Renaissance pulpit and excellent acoustics. At number 11, we have Casa Mattia, the birthplace of Matthias Corvinus, one of the most celebrated monarchs of his time. This historic house is a testament to Cluj Napoca's royal past. At number 12, we have the Matthias Corvinus Monument. Standing tall in front of St. Michael's Church, this statue pays homage to the 15th century king and the eminent figures from his reign. At number 13, we have Lake Tarnita. A popular summer destination, this reservoir offers boating, jet skiing, fishing, and picturesque views of the surrounding hills. At number 14, we have the Turda Gorge, a limestone canyon ideal for climbing and hiking. It boasts caves that were inhabited during the Neolithic period. At number 15, we have Kurtoska Lax. Delight your taste buds with this traditional Transylvanian spit cake, a delicious treat that goes perfectly with coffee. So that sums up my top 15 things to do in Cluj Napoca. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like on the video, and if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Until next time, have a great day.